Hello and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, I'm Count Christo and this is the Central Powers Collab series in which there is a glorious, glorious push into France on the go right now. We're, uh, we're pushing from the east as well, even though we're not making great headway over there, mostly just to try and hold as many forces on the east front as possible while we, uh, while we push in. Sorry, in, yeah, when I say east, I mean east of France. But, yeah, yeah. But yeah. But yeah, how are you doing, Shu? Apparent, uh, I guess. Uh, uh, doing well. Doing well. Good, Just kind of looking at this. It looks like the very south of the uh, Maginot line has a bit of a breakthrough. Yes, I'm Pretty trying great. to take advantage of it. You've got, f like, 60 divisions down there. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> they me. all seem to... Uh, they all seem to push through Mole House again. Nice. They really like that area. <laughs> Alright, ready to on pause? Yeah, I think so. Okay, let's go for it. Okay, I'm doing. I'm trying to micro it to make my guys as hyper aggressive as possible. Mm-hmm. I've always got oh, Vici. Yeah. If you like setting up a puppet regime. <laughs> uh, what now? Oh, no. no yes, just... yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm sorry, pretty you, sure you, you can't do a that. A little bit there. Oh, sorry. So, yeah. Right, uh, you up here. Okay, still going well in the south. I'm, uh, I'm taking province after province at the moment. Yeah, I'm just waiting for my troops to move into... Oh, did they change their direction? I don't want you to do that. I want you to take the land that's open. <laughs> it does tend to be the better strategy. How's the push going in the north? Oh, we're almost to Amsterdam. Yeah, things are... Things are going pretty well for the most part. There's a few fortified positions, but... Yeah, as you'd imagine. Probably trenches, if I had to guess, <laughs> considering. I apparently cannot order my troops to do anything. Anything at all? Yeah, they just won't listen. All the, those, like, 70 troops yeah. that are attacking... Ah, uh, you have to tell them to stop the attack the first. You have to to I was stop trying to. I was trying to click on Mole House. Or maybe they're on a, they're they're on in, a different province. Yep, that's, that's it. That's what it is. That is indeed there what it is, go. yeah. Good, glad we sorted that. Can't have you yeah. not attacking. I, need you to pull I, your weight. I just couldn't <laughs> notice. Yeah. Just didn't notice that little line there. Fair enough. There we go. I'm just garrisoning some ports to cover my advance. Mm-hmm. I feel like that's probably wise. Right, keep this push rolling. Yeah, it seems like we've gotten quite the breakthrough here. Yeah, definitely. On all fronts, really. Nice little encirclement going on down there with your armoured car. I like it. Mm -hmm. Why do we only have 57 armoured cars? Oh, that's right. I actually started training some divisions with them, didn't I? Yeah, yeah, I did. Okay. No, no worries. <laughs> Panic over. <laughs> Where did all my trips go? Well, I thought I had a whole bunch of armed cars. I was, I was concerned. <laughs> yeah. There's Grenoble. Been there a couple of times. Conquering all these places I recognize. It's funny. <laughs> mm -hmm. Right, all of you. I'm going to strategically redeploy some guys. My push on the on the west coast is uh, unopposed at the moment. <clears throat> yeah, it's very good. I also wanted to check the air map mode. Let's see. Yeah, still only 48 fighters. Not really. Not, not really going to look at that map mode anymore. It's going to ignore that. Not much point looking at it when you've got that many fighters. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to cut a whole load of people off in Lyon. That's excellent news. Ooh, yeah, it's really nice. Let's see if I can get across this river. Should be able to. Dijon. Yeah, I think I tried to a minute ago, but a troop walked into that province. Oh yeah. Okay, there we go. Nice. 
pocket established. Fantastic. Very nice. Nice indeed. Need to just adjust some of these front lines. We've taken so much of the land that they're currently being instructed to take, they're probably getting quite confused. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. I think I'm going to turn off your battle plan. It's getting a bit too confusing. <laughs> Having okay. yours and mine on the on the screen. Yeah. Come on, France, surrender. You know you want to. There are 80% national unity actually, so they've barely got progress towards surrendering so far. They're really, yeah, they're gonna. They're, very they're gonna be around for a little while. Gonna fight to the bitter end. It looks like, yeah. Yeah, you guys don't need to attack that one mountain province anymore, really. Which one? Oh, they, they, they're yeah. like, yeah, the four French troops in the mountains that are gonna run out of supplies slowly. Like, yeah. I prefer them not to attack. Forest, yeah. I think I'm just gonna. Uh, I want to leave the general attack plan though. It's the problem. Right. Um, how can I improve this attack? Oh, there we go. Yeah, that looks good. I've got 1,300 military experience at the moment. <laughs> I feel like I should use some of it. <laughs> can't seem... I don't know if it's just like because... Hey! Ooh, nice. My push to Amsterdam worked. Yeah, give me a, give me a second to figure out what's going on up here. Looks like England's landed, but for the most part they're being held off. I don't think they landed, I think they, uh, I think they were there. there. I encircled yeah. them, yeah. Uh, yeah, for the most part, that looks fine with me. But yeah, I'm not sure if it's just because of... Um... There we go. It seems to be an issue with the, like, lag between us. Oh yeah? Sorry, I can't, I can't pull troops away from... from Intr a lot of, uh, engagements. It's it's often it might be because you're yeah trying to send them to the wrong province quite a bit. Well, I mean, I'll try to, to just stop the engagement and then move them. And yeah, H it H looks like I finally got them to retreat. Good. H is a quick way to stop engagements. In case you didn't know, select a unit. Oh, okay. Hit, hit H. It will uh, it will cease moving entirely. Okay. Is it 16 yet? Yeah, it is. Time for some more infantry. Yes, it is indeed. Although I've been doing them a bit early, personally. I've got another yeah, hundred cool. divisions of infantry deploying to the front right now. Nice. Yeah. And there's mustard gas. Right. Yeah, I've almost finished getting all the new infantry equipment, actually. It's pretty nice. Yeah. I just started it all because I noticed it was only a month away. Yeah. Guys, not defending. I think maybe they're not messed up. Is that what it is? There are like empty provinces. Where? Confusing me. Like Besang, Besangyon. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Yeah, yeah fair enough. <laughs> right next to Dijon. Oh yeah, your front line doesn't extend that far along. Yeah, I think that's what the issue is. Although I have a guy in Besangyon. Yeah, I just. I would like to reinforce it. <laughs> sure, sure. No, any any reinforcements welcome, don't worry. Can't believe we still haven't taken Lyon. <laughs> it's a real tough fight for that city. Uh-huh. This offensive hasn't been that expensive in terms of lives, so I expected it to cost us a lot. But, yeah, uh, I'm I'm sure it's been a little expensive on my side. Well you've only lost about forty K so far. I'm surprised. Yeah. Actually. I really just don't have like superior the, uh, troops, obviously. Clearly. Glorious German Ubermensch. <laughs> oh, we finally took that one mountain province. That's good. Du -du 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 -du. 
The French are, must be super low on manpower. They've got such little equipment at the moment. They're still only on extensive <laughs> conscription, the poor devils. <laughs> Maybe there's some focus they need to do before they can get to better conscription laws or something. Mm, yeah, I'm not sure. Mm. I feel like France went all in on the war, though, so... It's not like a World War II situation where they're... No. No, you would think. You would think they'd just get it all unlocked early on. I'll have a look mm -hmm. at their focus tree. Um, I can't see anything that looks like, kind of, allow a bunch of manpower. Hmm. No, I don't think so. Hmm. Anyway, let's just keep this push going at absolute max speed. I'm, I'm uh, Paris is under threat. Mhm. Mm I was very pleased with this push. The British are landing troops in Brittany, but I'm uh, swiftly repelling them without too much trouble. In Germany? In Brittany. Oh, Brittany. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Now I have a single Chinese troop in nice. my in the heartland of oh, Germany. Yeah. Just weird. you know, is that China? Yeah, no, it's, that's Soviet. It does oh, look like Soviet. it does look yeah, like China, yeah. but it looks like it's got Chinese written on it, doesn't it? It's weird. Yeah, that's that's why I thought. Oh yeah, but look at the Soviet flag. It's weird. What the Soviet flag looks like now? Oh. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, I've never it just looks Chinese when it's when it's tiny like that. Yeah, I think it looks Chinese even when it's not that tiny. <laughs> not quite uh, like Chinese text, but it still looks a bit kind of I don't know Eastern. Not yeah, that I'm an expert. Wow, the British have just landed like 20 divisions down here. I'm currently trying to encircle them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is. They've got it's going to be quite the fight down there. Yeah. How's all this going? I've managed to bottle up those uh, British divisions that landed in uh, the Netherlands, fortunately. Hmm. Just working out quite well. Just about to wipe them out, hopefully. They're holding oh, yeah. Rotterdam pretty damn hard, though. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. I feel like there's a little bit excess of hey. the combat with going on here with my troops. <laughs> oh yeah, I, be I believe it. I've just taken Paris by the way. Oh, great. Yeah. French are uh, now at 77% of the way towards capitulation and I'm about to take Brest, which is a significant victory point as well. Another 20 victory points in there. And then it's nice. just uh, on to Calais. I need more rubber, but still no one in the entire world prepared to sell me rubber. That is a shame. Okay. Yep. Fall of oh, Brest. Look at that. What? The AI even got its own little encirclement. All right. The, uh, yeah. Um, nice. By the Maginot Line. Oh yeah, I see. Area. Nice. Oh, perfect. We got Strasbourg. <laughs> and it's exclusively trying to close it from the side that's got the river on it. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, I know. They're. <laughs> They try. They're not the smartest. But the they AI try. giveth. <laughs> the AI taketh <laughs> away. There we go. Oh, just reset them. Still holding in Italy, which is good. I kind of expected a sterner attack at some point, but it never came so far anyway. Hmm. Maybe I shouldn't speak so soon. Yeah. I mean, they don't seem to have all that many troops there. I'm not sure where all their troops are. The Italians. Maybe on boats trying to get... Yeah. Yeah, or Africa fighting the Ottomans. Oh, okay. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. Oh, no. My uh, line Oh, they're advanced. also in Africa fighting me. Oh, yeah? Apparently. Where are you? Yeah. In? Oh, down there, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The Ottomans are making a push in Africa. Actually, I'm going to join them. 
It's not going fantastically, but the British have very low organisation, so it should should hopefully turn around in our favour. We'll see. <clears throat> okay. Uh, pushing any further from Paris is proving tricky. There's a, a river and lots and lots of uh, British divisions deploying now. How many divisions are the British up mm -hmm. to these days? 300, yeah. 300 to 500 mm -hmm. yeah. British divisions. They're currently taking a mission called Secure Iran. That's, uh, are, they about to, are they about to declare war in Iran? <laughs> no, guarantee <laughs> Iran, okay. They're about to guarantee the independence of uh, Iran. You can see why they'd yeah, want to. Yeah. Iran's our way to the Shiraj. And the East in general. So who do you actually have to capitulate to win this war? China uh, and the United States and Japan are the ones that are going to be tricky. And England, is obviously. Is China really against us? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't even realize. Yeah, China is currently at war with us. They're doing a focus called appeasement. <clears throat> <laughs> That's uh, mm -hmm. not really working out for them. Is there a way to sort war participants? Uh, no. It doesn't seem like it. None, unfortunately. Yeah. Charge up there. Approaching Cherbourg. That's where I usually launch my uh, naval invasions of France. It's a great place to attack. Because it's planes to attack, mm. but then you can get quite quickly to Hills Hills City if you push out just two provinces. <clears throat> it often works pretty well. Yeah. Yeah. So we had people uh, in my comments saying we should play as France and Italy next. Which could be France fun. Yeah. Which could be fun, but I feel like we should try something more difficult, like, I don't know, Serbia and Greece or something crazy like that. Yeah, now that I kind of have the hang of what's going on, yeah. I feel like I could probably do a bit better. I think a ball I feel like... Sorry, go ahead. I feel like just going a bit slower, and yeah. um, now that I know what I'm doing, I feel like I could do a bit tougher of a game, Yeah, but I don't know. <laughs> Not quite ready for I a kind of Belgium obviously. Netherlands game then. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that'd be a fun one. That's the kind of max difficulty normally. Uh huh. But yeah. Maybe not max, but up there. Yeah, it's it's pretty difficult. Yeah. There's yeah. Almost no fortifications or anything. Yeah, and though you have got a good river to defend if you uh, pull back a bit. Mm -hmm. But that means you le lose Friesland, and that's two point five million manpower for. Uh, little map our population for the Netherlands gone which is very significant considering their size yeah and they've barely got more than that so yeah right so uh, we've gotten up, gotten over the river hmm? yes yeah we're uh, crushing them at the moment I'm having some trouble pushing into Nancy because they've got forts there that's the your old border uh, oh yeah yeah and there's still some of them holding in here and there. Can't believe they're still holding freaking. Yeah, can't believe they're still holding freaking Lyon. Nuts. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Look how many freaking troops there are down there. Yeah. All right, hang on. Order all your troops near Lyon to cancel their attacks, and uh, and then okay. we'll restart. Because if we restart all the attacks at the same time, we'll have significantly better chance of taking them out. There we go. Now we're beating them. Oh yeah. yeah. Yep. Should last less than a day, that battle. Good. Now we got him. A little bit of coordination, that's often all it takes. Have you seen the guys mm. I'm encircling, by the way? Is there any way to ping? Mm, I don't think there is. I don't know about that. There should be. Um, anyway. But, uh, yeah, look, pulling... look next to Paris. Just about to encircle about 30 divisions. Oh, I see. Along along the coast there. Uh, but no, still gonna have... no, just right next to Paris. One province from Paris. Oh, okay. I totally missed that huge stack. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I it's just a... that. yeah, it's a lot of the ice just there. Yeah, yeah, that'd be nice. Will indeed. I think I'm gonna adjust my battle plan a bit here. Okay. It's a bit off compared to what we're trying to do now. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. So close. If they don't retreat right now, they're doomed. 
And... <laughs> come on. <laughs> <laughs> one day, they've got one day until they're totally screwed. Let's see. Less than one day now. Because they won't be able to retreat in time. What are they defending as well? Oh, grasslands. It's beautiful. <laughs> I'm going to be able to totally bulldoze them. <laughs> They're trying. They're trying, but it's not going to be enough. Oh, there they go. Oh, oh. awesome. France has capitulated. Ha <laughs> ha. Very nice. Okay. Let's okay. just let me just reorganize. Uh, yes. Yeah, sorry. Sure. Um, thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, do go and check out Chu's channel and his uh, perspective of things. I'm sure he's been focusing on different stuff. So I've just been uh, laser focused on France uh, from the south. Mm -hmm. and I've had a different experience, a, a, probably a harder experience over there in the east. But uh, until next time, thanks very much for watching and we'll see you then. Bye-bye. <laughs> Later. <laughs>